How do you feel about being on, uh, how do you feel about your team? I love it. Like, this is the perfect scenario for us that, I, well, if you said what would you have chosen, I would have put it in, in order of drivers to hope choose you. I would have put Ryan first. And so, uh, I mean, it worked out good for us. And we've got a great team, Giuseppe. If they get that car figured out, he's going to be fast. He's always been a good driver. I like Giuseppe a lot. We've known each other for many years now. Um, and Rich, I mean, heck, he was on our team last year with Team X. And so the year before, too, you know, we just we just have a good relationship with Rich Bruder. And he runs good. If they have that car, same deal. If they have that car worked out, if they put the stuff into it that I know they have for this race, for this season, they're going to run good. Um, then we pick up Chuck. Well, Chuck's, we just got to get him a little faster. There's a, of course, everyone out there has picked on us a little bit. They picked on him too, or you're like, oh, you're on a team with Chuck. Well, I'm going to say this. I feel sorry for anyone who has had a disagreement with someone or been in a situation where you've had a disagreement and then they can't get over it. Like, that's got to be miserable. Well, you know, Chuck and I, we, Chuck, you, me, I, all of us, we kind of put it behind us. So Chuck's okay in my book. We'll take Chuck on the team and we'll go race. We'll help him get better. Uh, I, think, I think where Chuck shines is I think he's good with strategy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Very I think strategic. He ha he's very strategic. He's not a dummy. No, he's smart with that. And I think he'll help yeah. the team out and come up with different ideas. Yeah. Um, and I think, I do think as a whole, we can make him faster. Yeah. There are ways we can help to make we gotta figure out his how. combo faster. Got some ideas. Yeah. I mean, there's time. And Ryan's going to have them too. And we've got the month of, month of July for nothing to do. So we'll figure out what to do to the car. Yeah. Um, which I really haven't gone over and spent the time with it. Neither is Alan. And, and uh, it's, just, it's just a... There's probably a lot of room there. You can always see you can already see a few things just walking up to it. So hopefully. Teamwork. But he, but he does good. I mean Chuck's yeah. not a Chuck's not a I mean, it's not I, a slouch. I know he hasn't done good, but uh, he'll doesn't be, mean he can't. Uh, he'll be fine. He's, and I think he is a good driver, he is ballsy. He's I mean, ballsy. He is a, right. Behind the wheel, he's a ballsy guy. And so right. uh, it's a lot of positives about that choice no matter what. I understand it was uh you know, uh, it was it was four or five guy picking a four or five guy, and 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 there's nothing wrong with that. And, and when he said, "Hey, what do you think?" We were both like, Giuseppe and I were both, "Yep, right thing." So we're all good. I, it's just now uh, to make that come around. That's what a team's for, right? That's what I said. I was gonna say teamwork yeah. makes the dream work. Yeah, something like that. <laughs> all right. It'll still be. Uh, still be challenging but on the other hand you know anyone when you get down to that last pick you had uh, the, the the pool was small uh, I think Chuck was a good pick good. I, I think Chuck was a good pick um, I feel bad for some of the other guys that didn't get uh, picked but you know well that's one of the things we said when when asked about it on uh, the podcast you know like I wouldn't want to be that, and I feel I, I really feel for those guys who were. I get it. It was, uh, you know, frustrating, and of course it is. I mean, it just is. Nobody wants to be in that hey. spot. Right. So try not to wreck it. Yeah. <laughs> Nobody wants to be in that spot, and it's not fun. I understand that completely. It's. I can see why Doc is, well, Doc's fired up, and who can blame him? Like, he wants to be racing, and he wants, he had expectations of who would pick him, and, and they didn't. Um, I can't explain that. Doc has run pretty good as of late, so I don't, I don't know. Um, what do you do? Uh, I understand his frustration. I understand Reapers, and James, and I understand. I get it. I get it. Um, I think we were blessed that well, we've also run really well for three years. So yeah, put ourselves in a position to be picked early. Yeah, um, I mean we've got a great the work in. We put the work in already. 
we got a great tuner in house. Great tuner, great team, um, great support. We don't have anyone good, else tuning our cars. Yeah, good which equipment. is a bonus. Yep, our guy is at the track mm -hmm. every time. Every time. Yeah. He's reliable. smart, he learned. Yes. So we're smart, we learn. Yeah. Our support team, like Brian and all those the people we have, Brian Siles, they're great. Like this is uh this should be should be custom made hey, really well. Don't forget about the women on the team. <laughs> Yeah, and then you and Tara <laughs> right. make everything flow right. without, you don't miss a beat. And that's, uh, when you don't miss a beat, you don't lose races over dumb little stuff. And that's a <laughs> really big deal. Yeah. We, we've done that before. Yeah. And then we ironed it out by putting you two on the team and said, that's it. You guys got to figure this out and do it. And you did. And that really made a difference. That's when we started winning. So basically, the women helped you men. <laughs> we helped you men win a lot. It was over the top. <laughs> Just kidding. No, that's Girl great. Girl power. Is that yeah. how you say yeah. it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're good. So. Yeah. 